Okay, since a whole whopping more than three people asked me, I'm gonna do a um, update video, chest update. I'm nine months post-op, double incision, um, top surgery. So I did my last update at the six month mark, cause that's just what makes sense to me. And then I wasn't gonna do nine months, but since I did three months, I may, might as well fucking just do every three months for now. Um, so since the six month, um, I know when I did the six month video, I had just gotten massaged. And so my scars look insanely red compared to what they actually are. I haven't gotten massaged since then. Pin. This is my chest, nine months post-op. Pink, pink, this one's a little darker. Um, just doing the same shit, vitamin E. Sometimes I do coconut what I'm feeling, but mostly vitamin E daily, um, coconut daily, alternating sometimes. It's kind of like whatever feels, whatever I'm doing in the moment. Um, but yeah, so this is, it's not too shabby. Um, we'll zoom you in here. Pink, pink. I mean, this is just how my skin goes. Nipples. I don't, I can't feel this. Oh wait, actually, no, I don't know. I really don't even know if I can feel that. Hold on, this side. I can't. <sighs> Pretty much the same. Um, can't feel this. Definitely can't feel this at all. Nope. I can. F this is a little ting. This this is right here is a little tingly. Like it's weird. It's really hit or miss. Um, but yeah. So yeah, that this is my chest. Nine months post op. Um still healing i mean but honestly i think we're as good as we're gonna get but like if you've watched my videos before i already i've already said this a million times like i kind of knew i kind of signed up for you know getting chopped in half so i don't really if, if it gets better awesome i'm not trying to hide my scars i'm not trying to um yeah i just am uh i haven't been topless in public for a few reasons. One, I don't really have anywhere to be topless, to be honest. I've gone to a couple pools, but um, I'm wearing I'm wearing a beater there because, I don't know, doctor told me not to put sun on them for a year, so I haven't. Um, also, there's also the part where people knew me when I couldn't be topless and I had a chest and it's like, oh, okay, so um, you just take your shirt off now, huh? So I'm cognizant of like, um, I'm cognizant of like people and people not really being comfortable themselves, which normally it's like, okay, go fuck yourself. I, I don't care. Cause I don't care. But at the same point, like, especially with older people, I'm talking like older adults, uh, extended relatives, like people who are, you know, 50 plus and especially old people, especially grandparents, like they don't need to hear that shit. Um, it'll just, I mean, for Christ's sakes, I'm pretty sure my grandparents are still racist. Um, <laughs> all of them. I'm cognizant of like the company I'm around and I know that like I can't just like whip it out you know what I'm saying if it was my if I was hosting something and it was like my pool my pool party then yeah but if I'm a guest at some place somebody's house where they, they have guests it's like let me just tread lightly see my surroundings surroundings it's kind of like the same thing with everybody because even go even traveling and feeling safe when you go visit another town there's places in fucking like like Vermont that I've walked in and I, and like just because I had a shaved head and and people like people turn and look it's it's just like how life is so you have to be cognizant of where you are um other than that man no I um not too shabby I like it I love it <laughs> I love my chest um, you can get all the info for all of my, my surgeon cost, all of that. You can go in the description, you can go back and look at all my videos. 
That's all I gotta say. This is so boring. But hey, you ask, I give. That's all I gotta say. We're done.